Hey, Spider here, Next Gen Tactics, and NGT Zombies, Call of the Dead Soul Strategy, full game part 5. Uh, we just made it to round 18, with our little uh, circle circuit, George Romero style. Just waiting for these zombies to, uh, to spawn in, just having my second coffee of the morning. It's the day after Escalations come out, I actually recorded this last night uh, on the live stream. So if you saw it on the live stream, then you've already seen this. Uh, and if you have already seen this, I mean, I think you should watch it again. Because, uh, you know, I've got a different commentary. I was doing it live last night, now I'm doing it after the fact today. <laughs> definitely, definitely need to watch it again. Uh, if you want. So we're just waiting for these guys to spawn in. I think we got, had a max ammo right the, uh, near the end of the last round. Ooh, look, fire sale. It would be nice, it would be nice actually if there was like a box location out here. Uh, unfortunately there's not, but... Because uh, Treyarch hates us. <laughs> they do, seriously. But fire sale's kind of useless uh, mid-round on this uh, circuit. You know, again, unless you were to, you know, unless you had them all grouped up, you know, if, if there was a fire sale drop and, and you sort of needed a weapon, you know, and, and you had most of them already out here, you could wait a little bit, wait until they all grouped up, grab the fire sale, and then made run for a box, but, you know, <laughs> it's, it's gonna be pretty risky. I'll just say that. So, yeah. Um, I will talk about the two things that uh, are really the down downside of this strategy. Maybe we'll talk about the first one in this video and then we'll talk about the second one um, in the next video. Perhaps. Uh, let's see if it actually happens. There, there's one thing that actually happens to me a couple times during the uh, during this game and uh, I'm hoping that it happens in this round and when it does, if and when it does, then I will discuss that issue. Okay, so I think uh, they're pretty close to being spawned in here, so I'm going to turn around and shoot all of them. Again, be careful you don't hit uh, Romero, because he's not going to be very happy with you. Okay, so i got to switch to my HK. I actually haven't used the HK, uh, you know, all that much this game. I mean, I've had it for quite a while, several rounds. So we'll start using it here. And, uh, you know, make sure it works as long as I'm not aiming down my sights. Oh, yeah. But when you're running around here, like, you know, I think I, I do try it a couple times just to demonstrate the issues with it. I mean, aiming down the sights, you got low enough mobility as it is with an LMG. And you aim down the sights, you're just reducing your mobility even more. Um, and, you know, the zombies just end up catching up to you, so it's it's kind of pointless to do it. Alright, so I'm going to uh, go up the lighthouse here, and we're going to try and replace our AUG. It's a new dawn, people. And, like, give me the freaking ray gun already. Like, how many times do I got to pull from the box to get a ray gun? Stupid box. It be hunting season, my man. Okay, it's hunting season. Come on, give me something. Ah, oh, teddy bear. <laughs> Serious? Alright, so now we gotta uh, wait for this friggin' box to relocate. And get dizzy running down these stairs. Oh shit, there's George. I got the short end of the stick on that damn deal, didn't I? You sure did get the short end of the stick. Alright, we gotta wait for uh, George to come up here. So we go down. Actually. Probably go that way. I'm not sure. I don't know where the box is. That's the thing. I don't know where the box is yet. So let's get George off the stairway, stairwell, and uh, that way we can get on there. All right, let's do it. Let's do it. Oh my god! If you don't get freaking dizzy enough running the route, you gotta run the stairs and the freaking. You know, shaft here. <laughs> the shaft that is a lighthouse. So, I'm actually trying to figure out... Um, again, I don't have that great map knowledge yet. <clears throat> but you actually have to go up and sort of uh, 
Ideally, go back through your spawn. You don't want to get rid of that boat. That's the last thing you want to do. Don't uh, open up that barrier. Because then that's just another spot that the zombies can, can uh, spawn in from. So there's actually no other way to get over to the ship other than that way, I believe, from this side. So we're going to have to go up, up the stairs, back up the stairs, and um, back sort of our spawn way, I guess. To find the box that way. I think it's. I think actually the the box is in our spawn. But even if it was on ship side, no, 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 Spider, what the hell are you doing, Spider? You're such a noob. Yeah, up this level. There you go. Okay, come down the stairs and uh, yeah, there it is, right there in our spawn. So let's go see if we can pull. Now, I run into uh, a bit of a dilemma here, and you'll see why in a second. Let's uh, see what we get from the box. Come on, box. Oh! RPK. Okay. I got two LMGs. I got the HK and RPK, which is pretty sweet, but, but they're both low-mobility weapons. They're both low-mobility weapons, and I said that twice for a reason, because I want to get it through everybody's head. The HK and RPK are both low mobility weapons. Um, so I had a bit of a dilemma. I'm like, you know, Cryptic's telling me, no, no, get a different gun, get a different gun, you know, get the ray gun. I'm like, nah, man, I'll be okay, I'll be okay. So I went with, uh, I went with me. <laughs> I actually ran back here because I'm, I'm like, mm, should I or shouldn't I? Should I or shouldn't I? I don't know. Um, should I? I was. I think I was actually actually asking the guys in the live stream if I should as well. I think maybe I wasn't. Maybe I was just trying to decide on my own. And apparently, I can't make a freaking decision for the life of me. Just go with one or the other spider instead of running circles around the crawler. All right, we're going with the LMGs. Definitely going with the LMGs here. So. You know, and I'm thinking, with this route I'm running... Oh, sorry, I'm just stretching. Um, I don't need high mobility for running the route. Uh, you don't really get uh, in, in situations, and I haven't gotten to any situations where it's been... Oh, shit, you know, I need really, really high mobility because i got to, you know, scoot through a, a few zombies. Uh, you know, like on Ascension, when the zombies are, are coming up that stairway to the PhD uh, D flopper, the landing pad... And there are, no, there are no gaps, and you got to, you know, um, look for a very, very small gap and sprint through. Just looking up at the uh, the lighthouse there, seeing what's up. Um, you know, we don't have that problem here, so I think uh, the LMGs are good. So we're going to go and uh, finish these guys off. We're just uh, sort of drawing them in here. Just trying to keep uh, George in the middle, in the center of our position here, uh, while these crawlers come after us, so we can take them out. So let's see, let's see. There's one. Where's the other one? I can hear him, I can hear him. Where is he? Hello? Finally, a break in the weather. But it's actually nice to, you know, because I never actually got the ray gun, it was actually nice to have um, Speed Cola. Oh, there he is. Where the hell did he come from, man? And we got double points, so we'll wait until the start of the next round to get that. So we're on to round 19 here. And we actually haven't come up on, um, on that thing I was talking about that is one of the uh, downsides. Maybe we don't actually. Maybe it's all going to be saved for the next part. Hmm. I guess we'll see. Alright. Oh, Georgie. Okay, that was, uh, yeah. Get right there. You don't want to do that. I had him pretty tight to that, to that bottom side and uh, it didn't have a lot of room there. So we're uh, still running around, and, and even still, you know, especially with uh, with stamina up, and that's you know part of the reason I got stamina up was so that you have that added uh, level of mobility uh, and burst of speed, and, and uh, you know, you can actually sprint longer. Uh, it's actually pretty handy. Um, so it, it sort of makes up a little bit for the lower mobility of the LMGs. Whoa! Away from me. We're still circling around here. 
let them uh, let them all uh, respawn in here for a bit. Ooh. And uh, we still have double points though. That's the. It, but it doesn't matter. You know what I mean? Like double points really is of no consequence. I mean, look at my points. I, mean, I got 45,000. Do I need double points? I don't really. Hey. Zombies trying to come up on me. What the hell? Uh, so I'm actually uh, running out of things to talk about. Um, you know that the thing hasn't happened yet that I want to discuss. So I'm gonna save it until it does because I, I want you guys to see it. I want you guys to see it. Um, so maybe it actually won't happen in the next video. See, look at that. I, I see. I see. I aim down the sights there for a bit, but. <laughs> Again, as soon as you aim down the sights, you just slow right down. Even even slower than what we're running, so that's why I don't do it. And I'm firing into like a massive group of zombies. It's not like I need to aim down my sights. I don't need to get headshots. Um Really. So I mean I, I do um I don't know if I mentioned this. I, I think I mentioned while I was live streaming. I would have actually preferred to see to have seen something like uh, a dog round or a monkey round or something every few rounds, you know. Like I know George, having a, a, a George in there actually adds adds uh, an interesting element. But uh, I still would have liked to see some, seen something that occurs, you know, every few rounds or whatever. Um, it, it just makes it even that much more interesting, I guess. You know. Have dog rounds or something, and uh, let me get seven perks. I want seven perks, man. Seriously, I'm pretty sure with uh, the custom maps and, and the uh, the custom mod tools are actually coming out this month, supposedly, according to Trey. Custom mod tools, and uh, we're looking. Uh, we want to look at uh, creating some custom zombie maps, and maybe we'll allow. I, I'm pretty sure you can allow the ability to have more. Perks. I know I've uh, some of the games that we played on this channel. Uh, they're not exactly the same perks, but I'm pretty sure you can get like as many as you want. So, you know, maybe the the custom map we develop will uh, will allow uh, people to uh, to have all seven perks. And hopefully, they included the uh, Deadshot Daiquiri. To, uh, into the mod tools. Uh, that's pretty cool. We'll have that. All right, so we're on to uh, yeah, it didn't happen. So we're gonna we're gonna talk about around 20 uh, on the next video. We're gonna talk about the two things that I've been discussing the past three videos that I've failed to to clue you guys into, and I apologize for that. But uh, I wanted an illustration of it as well. So we will see at the next uh, the next video. All right, so stay tuned. NGT Zombies, it's where it's at. I'm Spider Bite, and I'm out. Looking for an awesome free game to play? Try War Inc. Battlezone with tons of weapons, equipment, and highly customizable characters. Sign up now and receive exclusive NGT bonus items such as 10,000 gamer points, 30-day rental of the XM8 Assault Rifle, and 14-day rental of the 2x XP Boost item. Click the link in the description to download this awesome shooter game now, absolutely free.